Title X came into being because the research showed back in the 70s that women who didn't have access to care had higher pregnancy rates. So this was the whole idea that women with low incomes could get access to care. Essentially, the mission of the program is to prevent unintended pregnancies and to promote healthy outcomes when individuals do decide to um, have families. The Title X program and the Title X clinics have been at the forefront and usually a step ahead of other centers that provide services. And I think it is because we've, we've spent a lot of time using Title X dollars to get there. You can go to a Title X healthcare clinic and get basic services that you need for your family planning or reproductive health. So you can get breast cancer exams, you can get cervical cancer exams, you can get birth control information and supplies. The patients come here for the vast majority of their healthcare needs. Um, and I think it represents a, a medical home. We have a lot of walk-in visits from teenagers that don't necessarily know their options and it provides them with the confidential services that they wouldn't necessarily know about or take advantage of in other clinics. I mean, people are bringing to you your, their sexual lives. That's way different than checking their ear for an ear infection. So I think it's, it's a culture. Title X is still important after the implementation of the Affordable Care Act. Many state legislatures are asking, why should we still give state dollars to a program that provides services for those who aren't insured when everyone should be insured. What we do know is that there's a gap and there are still people who need those services. A lot of people that go to Title X clinics or family planning clinics usually don't have any other source of primary health care. A $90 fee for insurance each month is the difference between groceries for their family or health insurance for themselves. It's important that the safety net not be dismantled uh, just because ACA is, has come into effect. So I think the most important thing that lawmakers need to know about family planning in the Title X program is the return on investment. For every $1 that Title X spends in our state, $5.40 is um, saved on the Colorado Medicaid program. You see a lot of need. and. A part of what I've seen is through Title X uh, services, you can start to actually alleviate some of those problems that lead to that need. Title X actually is a conduit to a better way of life.